welcome back. As always, my name is Oz. Today we're checking out a game called Nightmare at Famine Springs. This is by Dan McGrath or Tooth and Claw on Itch.io. I have played two other games by Dan McGrath on my channel before. Uh, the Incident at Grove Lake and Our Lady of Sorrow. Uh, so they were all kind of like both of them were found footage kind of horror games. Um, this looks very interesting too, so let's jump in and see what it is. October 31st, 1990X. In a small suburban town called Famine Springs, a young child prepares for Halloween. Okay, WASD to move. Hello, Mother. Well, honey, it's that time. It's Halloween. Go trick-or-treat with your friends. Oh, shush, you do have friends. We talked about this. You're not a weirdo. Go on, grab your costume and bag. Go have some fun. Oh, poor kid. He don't got no... He don't got no friends. Lieutenant Dan, you ain't got no legs. Got our trick or treat? Are we a ghost? Oh, we are. We are a spooky ghost. All that's in our living room are two couches. Do we talk to Mama again? Nope. Goodbye, Mother! Candy collected. Five. Talk to Kid. Nice costume, loser. Every year it's the same. Stupid kid, stupid costume. Bet I get more candy than you. See you later, dork. Rude. Rudy McRudy Pants. Well, I say I'm going to get more candy than thee. What's this? Another missing kid. I knew them from school. So many missing kids. Better be careful out there. Ah, uh, yep, I will be careful. Do I go up? Can't go this way. Alright, I can't go that way. I will go down. Let's be sly and just walk down the middle of the street. I can't go this way either. All right. Can't get candy from those houses. What about this one? Oh, what a nice costume. Here, have some candy. Be careful out there. Strange things happen on Halloween. Well, thank you. Thank you for the warning. Oh, is this that mean kid again? Maybe you guys have the lame costumes. The only thing you guys are wearing are masks. I have a full body costume. Hey. Didn't you egg my house last year? No. Okay then. Have some candy. Uh, thank you. Here's another house over here. Doody doody doo, give me your candy food. Wow, check out this costume. Ever seen a real ghost? You might get lucky. Worst things happen. Happy Halloween. Get lucky. Why would seeing a ghost be lucky? Y'all just hanging out in the middle of the road, eh? Give me my candy. Here, take this candy. Now with added razor blades. <laughs> I'm kidding. I swear. Yeah, that's uh that's very reassuring. Thank you so much. Ah uh, oh. 
what happened to this house? Candy? The house is boarded up. Oh, this house is boarded up too. What's going on? Are we in the bad side of town? We're in the bad side of town, eh? That house over there is boarded up too. What is going on? All these houses are boarded up. Oh. What's going on? Just like I thought. Not enough candy. <laughs> There's one house you can check. The old Furuer house down this path. You know the legends. I'm sure they're not true. You want to check it out? Off you go then. Uh, sure. Let's just go to this seemingly haunted house by ourselves. Because apparently candy is that important to us. Ugh. I love these kind of pixelated games, though. Spooky. Oh, they have a graveyard in their front yard. That's not sinister. All right. Enter the house. Oh, we're, we're not just knocking. We're going in the house. The old Fulmer house. This place is so old and full of old legends. Something beckons you inside. The door opens with a creak. You enter the house. Oh, we have discarded our costume and bag. Apparently candy is no longer something we want. What's up here? Woo! Hello! This door is locked. What was that? You find a piece of old newspaper. You can make up some words. Numerous children still missing. Worried parents blame local owner. Police searches have failed. Hope diminishing. You remember this story. Those kids were never found. That's comforting. I saw that. Actually, if I saw that glowing thing that, you know, just appeared and then disappeared, I would be... Whoa, Nelly! I would be out so. Out so. Goodbye. I don't need candy, thank you. What's down here? Oh, a uh, gate opens somewhere else. Okay, is this blued? Lots of blued? Alright. Oh, hello. Oh, what's going on here, man? These are cages. Press E to inspect cages. Yeah. Why are these cages here? They're also... human-sized? Each cage is empty. But they're filthy and stink. What was inside this cage? You shiver at the thought. Um... I have a feeling we're going to find out. Do I have, like, a flashlight? Or I am just glowing? What's down here? More. Alrighty. Press E to pull lever. I have pulled the lever. I bet that opens that gate back there. Let's go see. This is quite creepy for a pixelated... Yeah, sure is. Bet this opened now. It sure did. Alright. Um, I guess we'll go this way. Whoa! All of a sudden, an eerie figure appears, hanging in thin air. Your blood runs cold. As soon as it's there, it vanishes! Okay, nothing over here. That's comforting. Oh. Sir? Hello? Ghosts? Demons? It's me. Your girl. Whoa! He was big. 
I got a key. Where does this go? I haven't seen any doors. Um, is that blood there? This one way up here? Yeah, yeah, it was. Oh, the music has changed. What's going on here? Oh, Lord, the gate is locked. Oh, my God. Oh, that's a man. Hey, kid. What are you doing down here? That lunatic is going to get ya. The white-faced killer. He's real. You're going to die down here. <laughs> oh, that's comforting, dude. Um, Like all these kids did. Oh, God, there's more of them. Oh, boy. What's up here? Uh, holy cricket. Okay. That is a pentagram if ever I've seen it. E to inspect altar. Okay. What's this? An altar of some kind. Made of bones. Both human and animal. You lay your hand on the altar. And you hear a distant sound. Of moving metal. Has something opened? Just from touching the altar. Okay. Mm, this guy... Hey, this guy is gone. The guy is gone. What happened? Where'd he go? Guess we can go down here now. Oh, is this him? You do inspect book. You pick up an old book. You flip through the pages. There's something off. Strange symbols fill the book. Rituals and spells and names. As a, as a, as a. Narrow Narrow left left left. Yon. 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 You dare not read further. I recognize those names. Those are some of the great old ones um, from H.P. Lovecraft. Oh boy, it's one of those kind of games. Okay, lots of blood, lots of blood. Hello. Talk to kid. Is it? It's him. Well, well, well. Didn't get that candy, huh? Not to worry. There's plenty down here with father and I. You've met him, right? Let me introduce you. Oh, oh boy. Oh no. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh dear. Thank you, my children. I, I owe you power. I am the king and guardian of the fleet. As this is the future. All are hard in me. I know where the old ones will come to the world. And where they shall break through again. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I bet you. Do. Okay, that turned into an H.P. Lovecraft kind of thing, which I love. I love the world of H.P. Lovecraft. Not the man himself, obvious for obvious reasons, because he was very, you know, racist and such. But the world he created is chef's kiss. Anyway, that was Nightmare at Famine Springs, created by Dan McGrath or Tooth and Claw on Itch.io. Uh, be sure to check out some of his other games. They are just as fantastic as this one. So thank you all so much for watching. If you like what you saw, please like, comment, share, and subscribe for more content just like this. I look forward to seeing you all in the next video. Bye!